So today I'm going to be beating the rush mode on every single Black Ops 4 Zombies map. Now you might be wondering, alright, like Jake, how are you going to beat an endless mode? Well, you see, I've gone ahead and set myself a goal of reaching a million points on each of these maps. And now trust me, alright, I go through the emotions in this map, alright? I go through like suspense, absolute joy in Blood of the Dead. I mean, like you got to wait for that map, right? That map was crazy. And then absolute sadness. Like honestly, it, it's like a theatre play. So, you know, if you're ready to hit the fields, you know, buckle down, subscribe to the channel to help me hit 50k by the end of the year. And let's jump right into the video. Right on, boys, for our first map is Voyage of Despair. So as I said in the intro, the goal is 1 million points, all right, on every single Zombies map, or at least every single, like, you know, Black Ops 4 map. So if you don't know what Rush is, it's like an extremely just like a button zombie mode, where basically you just got to build up points in the bottom left, and you have a multiplier, and every time you get hit, I'm pretty sure you lose that multiplier, so we want to make sure we're not getting hit, because believe it or not, boys, you know, the less I get hit, the faster we'll make it to a million points. So I do have some, some cheeky gobble gums on, or elixirs, so we'll pop ourselves a perkaholic. Uh, what do we get? Uh, we got some okay perks, I suppose. Nothing, you know, absolutely crazy or anything like that, but I'll take it. Okay, we got a cat zombie round incoming so it's something that i found out in like the select few times i've actually played rush is that the shield is kind of goaded with victorious tortoise because as long as you're holding it out i don't think you can lose your multiplier i might be wrong about that actually should we test it uh no okay you do not lose it okay perfect look at that we even got an extra life oh we're gonna do a multiplier uh, okay cool yeah, that's the thing all right we just gotta keep on top of it i'm pretty sure like all the guns and stuff like that are free so what i'm hoping to do right is i want to get down to the mystery blocks and try and get myself the helion salvo we're kind of zooming through this i'm not even gonna lie but we're already at thirty thousand points i'll secret like, the world's best rush player or something like that oh, no, 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 we're about to lose our combo. Seriously, where the fuck are the zombies, bro? Okay, we saved it. Oh, man, I'm gonna be rushing. That's the whole point of the mode. See, this map's weird, though. I swear, some of the other maps, like, have you go into certain parts of the map? This seems to be just, like, go wherever you want, which is a bit random. Oh, here's the box anyway, so we can hit this little bad boy for free. Oh, we got homunculus. That's actually kind of big, you know? Oh, we just kind of hit it for, like, 30 seconds. Also, this is what I mean. Yeah, here we go. Upcoming rush in the lounge. Okay, what I want to do is I want to buy myself the Spitfire since it's good. It's actually kind of a monster. Oh, my God. I just got hit and I lost my combo. No, it's gonna take so long. Long. It was such a good combo as well. Oh, uh, you know what? It's whatever. We got a stoker incoming. See, I won't like, I always read that name as <laughs> it's a stroker incoming. And I'm just like, bro, this is some dodgy shit. All right, here we go. Bro wants a piece of the big man. Come here. Okay, he's gone. He dropped a load of his like rush pickup thingies. Just kind of huge. Back up to 70 multiplier already. Oh my God. Going absolutely bonkers, as I would say. Give me all of these pickups. Okay, I'm coming rush a pump deck. Make my way over there. We did get an extra life. We're kind of stacked up on lives, though. I'm not even gonna lie. We're already at five. Something to note as well is you do only have 150 health. So if you thought you could die quick in the normal game, Game. Wait till you play Rush. Wait, what, what is this gun, bro? I got a unicorn. Hey, where's the zombies? I'm literally gonna lose my multiplayer and I can't do anything about it. Wait, hello? Bro, oh my god, you just made me lose so much. Okay, well, we got the MP40. We're chilling. Could also come into our weapons, especially the Spitfire. You got a Blight Father incoming. Me and my homies do not fuck with the Blight Father. Oh, I do fuck with this insta kill, though. That is kind of massive. Oh, dude, this Blight Father is getting clapped up. I'll see you later, little boy. Oh my god, we are actually getting stacked up right now. Look at that, bro. We're already at 220,000. All right, and there we go. We're about a quarter. Okay, well, we mean, we're out a quarter there now. We're coming Rush boat deck. Oh my god, I took a big hit. Okay, hold up. I wonder if you get more points with double points active. You'd think you would, but I mean, you can never be too sure, can you? All right, let's quickly make our way over here. I'm just worried about me losing my multiplier while I'm like running over. Obviously, I just got a kill, so hopefully we won't lose it. There we go. Oh my god, bro, got the heal yourself up. It's actually too free. These stokers are kind of unfair, though. I'm not even gonna lie. Oh my god, this is this is not fair, bro. Oh my god, that was a massive, bro. We just lost all of our multiplier. That actually is so sad. Oh, that sucks, bro. Why did that take so long to pull out? Bro, honestly, bro, you'd think I'm a teenager who just got told someone's pregnancy results like bro like why does that take so long oh that's annoying all right whatever it's fine we're already bringing it back we're already back up where's that the hades no the, oh bro it's, what the fuck is laughing from that lmg okay big mistake actually i don't know bro it's kind of popping off what's underrated weapon in black ops 4 who knows okay we're back up to that 100 times water player making it out of these ends i do want to try and pack a winch if i can oh my god i'm gonna lose my water player oh uh, kill the zombie there we go it goes down so quick you don't like keep up with it i'm going like as fast as the game is letting me go you know we want to be careful about this stoker though there we go he's dead see imagine right the, the Unpack a bunch Helion Salvo is popping off this much. Wait till I pack a bunch it. The pack bunch is here. I'm losing my bolt player, which kind of sucks. But there we go. Game, where are the zombies at? Like, I feel like this is a bit unfair, you know? Like, get rid of my bolt player. No zombies in the area. Whatever. Right, we should be good, anyways. Now that we got this Helion Salvo, like, it should be a free 1 billion points. I mean, we're nearly halfway there. I'm hoping that throughout these maps, I'm going to get better and better at just not getting hit and getting to a million points. Should be quicker. Naturally. That's what you'd think. Oh, yeah. We're back up now. <laughs> Look, the Helion Salvo just makes anything in Black Ops 4 just so OP. I guess I could try and use this little poopy sniper rifle for a bit. Honestly, you know what? I'm taking away the word poopy. This thing is actually slamming up these zombies right now. Call me Tiger Woods because I'm just beating the fuck out of all of these zombies right now. That multiply, bro. Oh my god, it's actually so high. We're making it to one mil points. Easy peasy lemon squeezy, as they would say. Okay, never mind. All right, I've just lost my multiply. Uh, okay, I got a little bit cocky and it's really come to bite me in the ass. Okay, right, sometimes in life, you just gotta get humbled like that. All right, let's head down here. Is this area flooded? Okay, it is. Kind of s
so probably should have come down here earlier on to actually sort this out, but whatever. Not oh, cheeky though, insta kill. See, a part of me does like rush mode. It's just like, I, I feel like it gets a bit boring after a while. You know what I mean? Like, imagine you're just playing the same map. But it's one of those things where you just kind of have to get good. Like, right there, right? Like, I easily could have prevented myself from getting hit if I was just good. You know, I actually hit my shots. Hey, bro, if you say you don't like rush, at this point, it's, it's honestly a skill issue. I just actually get good, bozo. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna pack a bunch of this little sniper rifle here. See how good it gets. A savage razor, but it, it literally is like the exact same, you know? Bro, it's actually worse, bro. Oh my god, hold up. I just lost my. Bro, we're nearly a million points. Wait, what? What the fuck did they get to a million? You know what? I'll take it. I'm happy. Bro, I'm losing my entire multiplier. What is going on? Bro, the specialists, they just suck against the mini bosses. They actually do. You know what? If I had my Helion Salvo out, wouldn't have had that issue. All right, let's just get to the next area. Oh, yeah, bro. This thing has gone so poopy, bro. What has happened to this thing? Oh my god. Bro, what actually happened to this thing? It was one tapping, bro, and now it just sucks. What, what happened? Like, dead ass, bro. What went wrong? Oh my god, I'm literally gonna die. We're not. We're good. The rounds picked up so fast. Holy shit. Okay, well, let's get to the lounge. And then hopefully this is our last area. If I can build up a decent enough multiplier without getting hit. I just got hit. Let's go. Oh my god. Dude. Oh bro, even the Helion Salvo side the suck. Okay, never mind. We've got an skill. Okay, this got be it. Let's go. I am nearly out of ammo though. Shit. This is not good. <laughs> this is really not good. Okay, we've got the rampage shotgun. Okay, we're going in. Bro, I just keep getting hit, bro. Like, what is going on? Do I not have a shield or something? Like, that's how it feels. Not a single max ammo in sight either. Honestly, kind of criminal. Right, I literally need 50,000 more points. Come on, game. Just to be one solid. That's all a man's asking for. Okay, we're getting closer and closer. I'm 20k away. Surprisingly, this actually hasn't took as long as I thought. Oh my god, I got hit again, bro. I mean, I guess I could just like keep going until I die. But the locust, yeah, bro. I'm about to pop off now. Look at this. But why do the unpackable sniper rifles genuinely feel stronger than the pack of ones? Like, what is going on here, game? Like, what universe am I living in? Oh, okay, we're 6,000 points away. Just grab a few more of these little like pickup thingies. Oh my god, bro, how does this happen? Okay, you know what? It's fine. I'll just pull this out. Should be a million. There we go, boys. Bro, we honestly should have had that like a long time ago. I'm not even gonna lie, bro. You know what? It doesn't even matter. We got to a million points. So I cooked a little bit on Voyager the Spare. I mean, I suppose I could see like how far I can get. Oh, okay. Well, I mean, there we go. We had a lot of lives. Like, I'm only now down enough to get into a million points. My god, dude. I just need a max ammo, bro, and I can keep going. Did you guys play much Rush when uh, Black Ops 4 came out? Like, be honest. Because I just did not, like, at all. It was the same things with Gauntlets, except Gauntlets, in my opinion, they're just infinitely better. Like, I'm not even gonna lie. I think everyone can kind of agree on that. The thing with all of these modes, right, is they all just seem like such one off things, you know? Like, Gauntlets, right? Like, once you beat a Gauntlet, there's not really much of a reason to go back to it. Same with Rush. Like, to be honest, once you play Rush, like, once or twice, it, there's not really much of a reason to play it again. Like, it's just a bit boring. And I mean that on, like, one map. Obviously, like, if you continue to rotate out the maps, I can see it being, like, relatively fun. But then there's the issue where, like, most of the Black Ops 4 maps just aren't really it, to be honest. I mean, I don't know. So I just awful take on the Rush mode. I think I'm just getting annoyed because I've still yet to have a max ammo. Like, bro, what is going on with this? Like, bro, I'm asking for one thing here. Oh my god, dude. All right, well, you know what? Uh, I don't think we're lasting too much longer if I had to be completely honest with you. Yeah, I'm just not going to get any points, bro. I'm just, like, losing my multiplier pretty much instantly. That's so fast. Like, I wonder what round we're in, technically. We must be in, like, the 30s or something by now. Once again, I'm pretty much out of ammo. But we're basically back where we started, I think. Yeah, look at this. It's all come around, boys. At this point, now it's just a case of whether or not I'm going to get myself a max ammo at some point, which it is not looking too good for me. I know you can get them, but so why are you not getting them? What is that? Okay, if he's just like floating in here, like you do, Black Ops 4. Getting a high early game multiplier is just so big. I gotta keep an eye out for that. But what is going on? Uh, hello? Alright, we're good. Well, I've, <laughs> I've literally got no ammo and, and literally nothing to my name, so <laughs> I think this is it, boys. I'd spawn myself in a shield, I suppose. It kills this way. Oh, well, nice game. Thank you for the insta kill. And still yet, <laughs> and again, not a max ammo. And the carpenter game, honestly, for like the sixth time. How would you get max ammo? Said, I don't understand it. Okay, I'm gonna have to do some like looking up, you know. Okay, I just died. Because yeah, I just do not understand why there's no max ammo spawner. Is it like you've got to go an entire rush without being hit or? I honestly don't know. Oh, okay. All right, you know what? Let me just end everyone's suffering. There's nothing I can do. I, I was yet to even reach 1.2 million. There we go. Okay. <laughs> All right, well, we reached a million points on Voyager's Spare, so I'm happy. So let's go ahead and move on to our next map for this video, which is nine. Right then, so on to nine. Now, I remember this map actually being quite difficult. And you know, like I made a video on it before, but this time, all right, it's going to be different. I'm a new man. So did I look up what the deal with max ammo was? No, I just completely forgot it. But again, it doesn't even matter. I'm not even going to get hit a single time. Like, watch this. You're not even ready. So this is easily one of the best maps in Black Ops 4, let's be real. I feel like if you're out here saying 9 is like a bad map, then you're easily just, you know, a blind hater of Black Ops 4 zombies. The more I play Black Ops 4, the more I can like see the idea they had, and then I can just see like why it just did not work. Like this and like Dead of Night, I, you know, are just timeless classics. Genuinely like some of the best zombie maps in the entire franchise, which is kind of crazy to say. A lot of people would just be like, oh, Black Ops 4, one of the worst games. But like, unironically, I do actually think that 
that some of these maps are like some of the best in the entire franchise except for like alpha Bego and voyage and, and honestly tag like those maps are like mid to like bad that's just you know my opinion i suppose but we've actually built up an 86 times multiplayer and i'm about to lose it just like that hello G game where the fuck are the zombies okay there we go i was gonna say like bro like it's just no zombies. i'm where it's told me to go no zombies in sight criminal game obviously i do want to be keeping up my shield whenever i need to you know not get hit hopefully i won't take as many dumb hits this time around because i won't have the stokers on my ass the stokers were like genuinely ridiculous like i don't know what it was but they shot out some kind of projectile that just ruined my multiplier in seconds so hopefully this time will go better i mean look at this we're already at like nearly 2,000 points or 200,000 points sorry i mean i can't look at numbers clearly british man can't see numbers yeah we're honestly not doing too bad you know but the argus had a bit of an l but you know what we move again i am trying to get that helion salvo out the box even though it did me kind of dirty with front you know running out of ammo that's not the helion salvo's fault that was just by lack of fault absolutely hating me I, to be fair i could put on the max ammo gobble gun i could be the shout oh look at this all right i'm developing tactics okay we do have the uh brawlers i don't know why they were called like the, the more readers or whatever hey, look at that i got max ammo like, why did i get a max ammo though what did i do differently i didn't get like any special numbers or anything it just gave me a max ammo just like nah bro we got you unless it's one of those things that eventually just fizzles out to make the game harder look at it, bro we're at 200 more like bro we're actually speeding through this honestly like if i don't get hit we could have this done so quick <laughs> this could be the quickest map i just gotta like live really well we also got an uh, insta kill there and a nuke look at that multiply going up oh my god we're nearly a half a mil bro what is going on i gotta pick up the commentary a little bit bro this <laughs> the video is gonna be like five minutes uh, oh my god i'm gonna start losing my multiplayer where is the zombies at okay there we go uh, the cordite i mean that's honestly not bad i guess i'll take it for now okay, we do have the destroyer bro oh my god just call him the gladiator game like he's not him <laughs> for some reason whenever i think of the name like destroyer i just remember that pitbull which is like a meme <laughs> it's just like dog named like princess destroyer or some shit like that i'll probably put a video on it on screen so you know everyone has the context of that i don't know why that just reminds me of that but also we are literally at like a 300 times multiplier i am popping off in this game of nine right now see if i don't get hit here like this is what would be like a really good run if that makes sense like i'd be on like line for two mil points if i play well i mean look at this bro luna was also a massive like work to get she's just helping me keep my multiplier up constantly building it so it's the abr i mean that's not the greatest thing in the world oh okay we do have tigers but <laughs> look at that stare bro <laughs> I'm literally about to make it though to a million points. Like, we are so close. Maybe we can get a cheeky max ammo. Oh my god, bro, you'll step away. Okay, game, are we starting the rush or like what is happening here? Okay, there we go. We're all good. Ooh, nice little insta kill here. That's actually really good. We're about to hit a million points. Look at that. Oh no, bro, no, we're multi player. Multi player. I just said, I'm pretty sure. Okay. Well, either way, we made it to a million. Oh my god. Hey, stop being a clown. Oh my, holy shit. Okay. Bro, thank god we just hit a million because I went actual goofy R moment. Oh, we're bringing it back though. We're already on the comeback. How does he do? It. This is honestly like one of the best games of rush I've ever had. If I didn't get hit there, I could have built up like a thousand. Okay, well not a thousand, yeah. Let's not get ahead of myself, but like a, maybe like a 500 multiplier or something like that. Bro, it would have gone so crazy. This area is just so unfair though. Like, what the fuck? I thought I didn't get hit there either. Bro, and then two max ammo's game. What a way just to say fuck you. That is disrespectful game. We're already back up to like 200. Oh, I'm, I've lost it, bro. That is so. What am I meant to do here again? You literally need the Helion Salvo. I swear. Just get it over and done with. There we go. Thank God. I mean, to be fair, we, we've already like taken over our Voyager spare score. We're not doing awful. I could just get some luck with the box next time I'm there. I don't know, boys. This could be a really good game of rush. Maybe hit two mil points. No, I mean, we're losing our multiplier now. Was that the Mozu? I remember when the Mozu, the Mozu, whatever you pronounce it, used to be like the best weapon in the game. It genuinely used to be so OP. Oh, well, here we go. We got Blight Fathers as well. Oh, here he is. Here's the big boy. I mean, I guess I could pull up my specialist. The only thing is, is I don't want to get too close to him because then he will just kind of like own me up. Oh, bro, what I get hit by? Oh, it was this guy's fucking axe, wasn't it? Oh, what a knobhead. There's a lot of like gut thing here. Okay, hold up. Let me cook. It's insta kill. Okay, hold Hold up. Okay, and I got hit somehow. Okay. Literally insta kill. Everything's getting handed to me. Somehow still gets hit. How's he do it? We're getting closer to hitting 1.5. Two mil, you know, might be a bit much. Maybe. If I don't get hit and I can get back up to like a 200 multiplier, it could happen still. Ah, oh, there you go. I just got hit again. See, I know I just said like if you get hit, it's kind of a skill issue. And I do stand by that. But BO4, it's one of those games where you do just genuinely get hit by like the most random shit. So for a mode where getting hit, you lose your multiplier for points with a bit of a wonky hit system. You know, it's not the greatest combination in the world. Okay, how often? can i buy this no okay oh my god it's like a two minute delay okay, let's not do that okay yeah i'm just getting bashed up now oh my god thank god we had that really early like water player because this is getting a bit ridiculous now yeah i think 1.5 is probably going to be our max here but we'll stick it out until i eventually die just like we did on voyage see which map is going to be my highest map my guess is probably going to be this map now i don't really think a map is going to like take this over one point well we're nearly 1.6 mil points is pretty insane for me see it's just that the later rounds just become so ridiculously hard to not get hit especially if you've got like really weak weapons because let's be honest the weapons in bo4 they're not the strongest but that's why it really feels like unless you have the helion salvo like you're just like a massive
massive disadvantage. Oh my god, bro, just I don't, Bro, are you actually serious? I got Dying Wish. That's actually ridiculous. Also, is this the second time I've been in this area? I actually can't remember. I feel like it is, which means we've done a loop of the map now, which is kind of wild. I actually didn't think we had made a whole loop yet, but again, I could be going like full schizo right now. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> We're fucking dead, bro. Wait, how am I not dead? Wait, what? You know what? I'll take it. No, never mind. Now we've got to be dead. Like, come on. Uh, what is going on here, game? Game? It, what, bro, what? What am I meant to do? I, I need to shoot him. I just actually sat there and just got like bummed by this blight farmer. I do have my PhD slider, to be fair. How good is that? Uh, pretty fucking point. <laughs> pretty useless, bro. Oh my god, bro. Oh my god. Let's go. This is the start of the downfall. I lost Luna as well. I'm clinging on to Hope here. <laughs> it's not looking good, though. Oh my fucking hell. <laughs> I actually want to see what some of like the world records are for Rush. I am like genuinely curious now. My guess would be that they probably do use like the Helion Salvo or maybe even an, like a Mega Elixir. Like, uh, like, I can't remember the name. It's now like Wall Pack. This is it. The one that like basically gives you like a pack of into a weapon. So then you could go into like any room and get yourself a new weapon. So ammo shouldn't really be a massive issue. Oh my god, I'm just getting hit by. Bro, what the what was that? Bro really just said, nah, I'd win. Dude, this has to be one of the harder maps for Rush. Like, the areas are so close quartered. Like, it really does feel like you can't catch like two minutes without getting just bummed by a zombie. No matter how clenched your asshole is, they're getting in there. Okay, we've got the Hades. If I could pack them just real quick, this could be a big investment. Oh my god. Uh, no, 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 no. Okay, we didn't get hit somehow as well. We kept that multiplier. Yo, we're bringing it back, boys. We're getting to that two mil points. In hype now for, for Rush mode. Okay, we've actually built up another semi decent multiplier. Hold up. And we got this thing as well, full power. Yo, hold up, bro. Yo, let me cook. I do need to get killed, though, or I am going to lose this multiplier. So there we go. Yeah, 94. Not the greatest thing in the world. Bro, how far is this thing? Oh, bro, this thing is actually kind of far. Um, no, I did not consider how far this was. Well, there goes our multiplier. <laughs> Just like that. Oh, we kept it a little bit, I suppose. Yeah, this Hades is actually pretty good. Bro, what? I pulled up my specialist and then just immediately got hit. Bro, that's actually just not fair. An actual Black Ops 4 moment. Okay, genuinely, like, I was actually, like, pretty much done with this map, but now I'm only 200k away and I've kind of got a new goal. Actually, just let me out on, bro, like, scrappy do style. It's a slow grind, but it's a grind nonetheless. Game, hello. There we go. Next up is in the flooded crypts. Let's go ahead and make our way down there. Got the Reaver, bro. And still yet to have that Helion Salvo, which do kind of suck. I'm not even gonna lie. All right, this is a make it or break it right here. If I don't get hit and I can build up, as I said, a semi decent multiplier. Of probably like 200. We could make it to 2 mil points. Oh my god, okay, we got cornered. Alright, pull out the specialist. Bro, oh bro, what happened, bro? I just lost it in seconds. That sucks, bro. Oh my god. And I'm only like 100k away. That's actually some booty cheeks, bro. Oh my god. And you know it's bad when I'm saying the word booty cheeks, bro. Like, that's just a vocabulary I just don't even use anymore. Oh my god. Okay, we still might make it though, actually. We kind of brought it back a little bit. Hold up. I'm going through so many emotions right now. It's actually unreal. Okay, this insta kill. Hopefully, everything goes well. Okay, it didn't quite get me. Oh, hold up. I'll pick up all of these. We're actually so close. Yeah, we're about to get it. Uh, where are the zombies at? There we go. We made it to two mil points. Yeah, I'm happy. I can die happy now. Obviously, there's no way we're reaching it to three mil. So let's just, you know, not get our hopes up. Yeah, I mean, look at this. I'm just getting kind of collapsed up right now. Oh my god. Oh, bro. Okay. But look, all right. We exceed that. We doubled our goal. Like, look, I'm happy. Kind of getting to a point now where it's getting a bit too ridiculous with, like, the zombies' health. Like, come on, look at this, bro. Oh my god. Um, I just still can't believe I lost that entire more player because of those uh, gladiators or just a bunch of zombies. I don't even know what caused it, like, genuinely. But, bro, we would have had an insane more player. Probably like upwards of like 250 if I hadn't been hit there. But I mean, you I mean, I'm getting hit now, so okay, we're pretty much at the end of it. I don't think there's much luck for me surviving here. All because I didn't get the Helion Salvo. All right, surely this is the last place we're going to be able to do a rush at. But the game always is giving me false hope, though. Like, genuinely. We built up a nice little cheeky 81% multiplayer. What's say percent, bro? What am I even yapping on about, bro? Rush is like giving me brain rot. This little game, you give me like a 160 multiplier, and I'm like, you know what, boys? Maybe 3 million is possible. But in like the next area, I'm just going to get actually domed. We've got homunculus, though. Bro, like, look at this. Bro, stop giving me home. Oh, and then it just gets me hit with a fucking tiny you little rat, bro. I actually fucking hate the. I'm out of ammo. I didn't even realize. Okay, hold on. <laughs> it's like, this is not good. Oh, uh, I think it's safe to say uh, we're probably dead here. I don't think we're making it out of these ends. Maybe there's about to be the world's biggest clutch up of 2024. I don't know. I don't think I'm him, though. I don't think I'm going to be able to pull it off. Like, I don't think I'm him, though. I don't really think I'm going to be able to pull this off. Okay, okay. <laughs> okay, it's not actually done. Can I head up here? I actually can. Oh, okay. Yeah, I think this is probably where we max out. It's because of the ammo again. I think. I'm just gonna put on a max time. Oh god, we're going after this. Honestly, you know what? 2.3 million points. I'm genuinely a little bit surprised. Also, I mean, look at challenge phonia, bro. Are you serious? I know I've been turning it for like last like four rushes, but this time it is actually over. Like, there is no way. I struggled to survive the first time it put me in this challenge phonia. All right, well, I mean, here we go. Absolutely nothing to my name, but it's gonna be the biggest comeback. Look at this. <laughs> it's actually over, bro. All right, you know what? Just take me. Uh, there's nothing I can do. Look at that, boys. Look at those stats. Actually stacked up right now, but 2.3 million million points. Yo, honestly, I'll take it. I'm actually really happy with that. So, yeah, that is Black Ops 4 done. Let's just go ahead and move on to our next map, which is Blood of the Dead. Right then, boys, so Blood of the Dead. Go ahead and pop ourselves our perkaholic like usual. Oh, what do we get? We got some absolutely dookie little perks, though, which
like literally <laughs> all of these perks are actually so bad yeah, i'm unbelievably up right now but yeah this map i think it's probably going to be one of the harder ones because blood in general is just like not an easy map at all bro, and especially when i'm getting hit and losing my combo this early on bro like that is just not a good sign yeah, as you can see i changed up the gobble gums a little bit but max ammo is on hopefully that's going to be the biggest clutch up in the entire world especially if i can get the healing on server right now then okay we've got the mog 12 bro i'm sure all of the little 14 year old gooners as you guys would say are uh, giggling at the word mog do i understand it i still don't genuinely need a history lesson like i'm a certifiable gamer but the word mog just means nothing to me <laughs> i don't understand it bro i'm like bro why am i sucking so bad right now Team, come on get in the jake you know get in the game come on let's stop goofing them out here i don't know how this has gone so like unbelievably bad what has happened here you know what it's fine it's about to be different all right i'll have to make the change this camo as well look at this bro this thing's crazy i actually don't think i've ever done rush on blood of the dead like unironically Maybe really because you know when blood of the dead came out uh, it was pretty much like the number one hated map I actually i'm curious what map do you guys think was hated more when the uh, black ops 4 came out voyage or blood of the dead i'm actually genuinely curious part of me wants to say it was probably voyage but dude with all the crashes on blood of the dead like i remember bro people trying to solve the easter egg it was actually outrageous so i don't know i can see a side of a bowl in the comments right when black ops 4 first came out right only when black ops 4 first came out we're not talking like after playing it for like what how long has black ops 4 been out like five years bro that is actually kind of wild but yeah you know not when blood of yeah right like it, five years ago play these maps for the first time which one did you like dislike more i'm genuinely curious so we've got the rampage i guess i'll take it i'm a little bit worried if the game puts me on the catwalk i feel like i might lose my multiplier which will kind of suck because again i'm trying to build up as high as possible so we can reach 1 million points as soon as possible just so i know i completed the challenge also i'd love to be able to see game but you've got fucking upcoming rush times square locked in my screen right there oh my god dude this area is gonna be so difficult did the hands make me lose a multiplier i hope not i feel like that'd be like way too unfair if it did i mean so far i'm actually yet to get hit by one that is genuinely surprising unless they just like remove that like you just can't get hit like they must have also we got dogs now infinitely just better than the tigers in my opinion like tigers are actually a bit of a joke oh my god just gotta make sure i don't get hit by them and it looks like we made it all right you know what not too bad could do with some ammo i might have to put this max ammo gobble gum soon to be honest with you like my guns aren't great but i felt like the rampage is probably like one of the oh we got max ammo <laughs> i was gonna say bro, i feel like the rampage is probably one of the better things i've got so you kind of want to keep this on check i don't know why bro playing black ops 4 right now like i just feel like i can't see anything bro like unironically actual blind in game oh my god bro how did i not get hit there yo we're cooking that bro go in for a second got a cheeky insta go here as well you know i'll pick that up as soon as my uh specialist is gone we're already at 300 000. we're making some big big moves to be honest honestly like oh dude and we just got our weapon specialist back Ooh, okay hold up it'll be a big moment as long as i don't get hit here and i could build up a multiplier of maybe even like 400 if like I, I really just pop off like this could actually be massive for us i just need to make sure i don't lose my multiplier plus these dogs are a little bit scary i'm not really a big fan of that i guess i could just pop my uh spectral shield though to be fair and that way they can't hit me all right game like come on where is this last dog honestly this is a good time to ask the question like what was the dog doing okay where is this area this is all the way like down here as well okay it is that's not too bad i could make this work just keep my multiplier up run around with my shield okay that uh insta is actually kind of big it's like kind of but it's actually like humongous bro oh my god and we got one of these bad boys okay hold up bro this could be the biggest moment ever for us we could genuinely reach 300 uh times multiplier here okay i'm gonna pull out my specialist again and i'm gonna just go to town bro like honestly hold up let a boy cook serve you up a five star dish real quick honestly bro gordon ramsay gonna be reacting it's like a tiktok oh my god we're actually like kind of going a bit sicko mode here again my guns do kind of suck which is a bit of a problem that's the only issue i'm kind of like having right now if my guns were like really good i could genuinely try and keep this 300 times multiplier but whether or not the game wants to be a bit kind of me and give me what i need so i hate that they removed the box spawn here from mother the dead like it actually gets me every single time you know what zombie shell actually isn't too bad like in this mode like in the actual zombie it's a bit cheeks but all this mode i mean it's not doing too bad oh my god i actually thought i was gonna get hit there it's not doing like awful let me just buy the spitfire as well just so we have a weapon i'm gonna get a chance to use this insta which kind of sucks but sometimes it really do be like that oh uh, you know we have got a little like chance to use it to be fair oh my god no 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 okay i think my plan here is i'm gonna pop undead my walking so i can kind of take my time a little bit more this area of the map is a bit on the squeaky side and i really do not want to lose this combo like this combo is huge bro oh my god is that a fucking power up oh my god okay hold on okay, let's just use this get a bunch of kills we're about to hit 400 and we're about to hit a million points it's just like that bro i didn't even like react to it. it didn't even phase me bro light work no reaction okay let me pick up this bad boy now so we can just keep it going oh my god bro wait what i swear i just hit 400 multiplier before wait what i didn't get hit does it hold for that little now like does it just immediately start going down no i don't really understand that okay whatever got double points out there i don't know if double points actually does anything i assume it does but oh my god okay pick this up we gotta keep our multiplier up oh my god look how many we're getting every time we just pick up like one of these holy shit bro going in right now <laughs> Uh, I could do with trying to package my weapons, like, honestly. Uh, I feel like I'm going to probably lose my multiplier, though, which kind of sucks, but...
but I, I kind of just legit need to pack a bunch of my weapons. Can I pack a bunch of one? Oh my god. Right, and we kept the water plant. Let's move. We'll come back and do the Spitfire in a bit. The vapor, I mean, because it's better than what I had. It's no harm in taking it. I was gonna pop my specialist here. We could get to two million points just right off the bat, honestly. This again, this could be our easier. Again, this actually could be our best game. Bro, what is going on over there? Bro, game had me so flabbergasted on what's going on here. I actually like wasted a bit of my specialist just to look at it. They're all just getting stuck over there. What is going on? Boys, are you guys good? Also, holy shit, we're like really close now to a 500 times multiplier. Bro, low key cooking right now. I had that like shitty start where I just like lost all of my score, but we're, bit, we're bringing it back. We're back on the rise. Okay, that instill is actually also kind of big. Um, do you want to pack one to Spitfire if I can? So let's try and not get hit here. And I guess let's head up to like gondola. This one is going to be really difficult. So I might have to pop in the mother, uh, undead as I'm walking for this. Oh no, it's just going to take me up. Okay. Bro, game, I'm literally going to lose my combo and there's nothing I can do about it. I just got to sit there and watch it. That is honestly kind of heartbreaking. Okay, there is a thing at the top. So I guess it does try to save it a little bit for you, but you know what? It, it's fine. What, what's done is done, game. You've already hurt my combo, hurt my dignity, hurt my pride. Let's just go. Let's go to the Warren's house. The only thing is, right, is you need to kill a certain amount of zombies for the rush to actually start. And I don't want to rush all the way over there real quick. Little, you know, pond in there. Because I don't want to sit there and just say, like, those zombies spawn, just lose my multiplier right off the bat. So I like to wait until it tells me, like, I need to go. So there we go. Like this. Now, this could be quite difficult. This area is not the biggest in the world. Got the mozu from the box. Don't really want that. Also, we're at 2 million. I just realized that. <laughs> if we can keep up this combo, this can easily be like our best game in this video. Like, guaranteed. I don't think there's going to be a video that's going to probably top this one. But I'd say a video, like a map. Uh, this route is going to be a bit of a squeaky little boy, though. Oh my god. Okay. Um, One of the world's biggest shield pulls out ever from a COD zombie player. Uh, I'm going to pop this. And there's my walk in because this is a little bit too squeaky for me. Try and take out the warden. Come on. You need to go, bro. You need to go. Come on. Oh my god. Nice. Okay. And we got full power from us. Okay, hold up. We're at 600 times. Bro. There's another one, bro. Okay, this is it, bro. Like, I'm getting so hyped up right now. We're about to hit 3 mil. This is a gigantic combo. Holy shit. Okay, literally, like, we're about to hit 3 mil. Um, <laughs> there, there it is, bro. Oh my god. This is a crazy game of rush for me. Oh my. Like, I, I'm actually left speechless, bro. Flabbergasted, I would say. The only thing that would make this better is if I can get the Helion Salvo, which I don't think I'm going to be getting uh, by the looks of it, which does kind of suck because the Helion Salvo would make this, like, an even better, like, run, to be honest with you. I think at that point, I'd, I'd genuinely be like unkillable, especially with the max ammo gobble gum. What's nice about having like this high of a multiplier as well, right? Is even if I get hit and lose that, it's not just gonna immediately just deplete the entire thing, right? Like it goes down like a good chunk, but you don't just lose it like a nearly 700 times multiplier right off the bat. So let's just keep going. We do have our specialist back. I am kind of running low on ammo, so I might pop a max ammo real quick. Oh, did I just pick up a max ammo naturally? Surely not. I'm starting to think I might have. You know what? It's fine. Oh my god, bro, an insta kill. The game is just handed it to me. Yo, I'm actually curious. What is the world record for like <laughs> Blood of the Dead Rush. I don't even know. Oh, it, it, apparently it's 41 million points. So we're definitely not getting any world records in this one. Oh, that double point has been slight. Okay, can I get it? Oh, bro, we lost so much more. But I should not have gone for that. That was not worth it. Absolutely not worth it at all. I was like, bro, I don't even know. I lost like 60. Oh, that was just not it. Why did I even do that? I thought that was the big brain play. I thought I was probably going to lose like 20. But nah, we also just hit 4 million points. Um, Excuse me. We're actually not getting points anymore for picking up those. I don't know what they're called. Point thing. We're actually just not getting points anymore. Wait, what? <laughs> I maxed it out. What do you mean, bro? I've maxed it out, bro. Okay, hold up. Like, something's gone gone wrong here, surely. Um, well, I mean, I guess I literally can't get any. <laughs> That's fucking stupid, bro. Okay. Well, I mean, it is a even the point. Four million points, bro. That's the max. Bro, I've hit a world record. Okay, I I'm tying with them. Okay, why would they put a max of four million? That is the stupidest decision I've ever seen. Bro, that is crazy. Okay, I don't even care anymore. I suppose there's no point of continuing. I am actually in shock. We also just like lost a 700 times water player so I i'm not even too bothered if the you know game ends bro, how does that max it out surely this this isn't that max how did that guy hit 41 million then oh i guess you just keep going and then the game gives you a final score at the very end like that kind of sucks i kind of wish i tried a bit more now but it's honestly really unsatisfying now getting like kills and building a water player when you can't actually see the points going on i mean we had a crazy water player though I, I don't think any map is gonna reach 4 million points we got really lucky with drops over there to be fair like it was really just dependent on how many like insta kills and like look at this bro like another insta kill but like that and like the the full power stuff without that like it just would not have happened so unless we get like another really good like run like in a different map this is probably gonna be our best one for the video i actually really do like genuinely enjoy blood of the dead now like i don't think the easter egg is as bad as people made it out to be like the more i've done it it is a difficult easter egg but i guess it depends on what type of easter egg you like i wouldn't do this on like a daily basis or anything like that i just don't think it's that bad i've already gone over like what i prefer for easter eggs and that's like the really short and simple ones like infinite warfare ones i don't know why they're just really fun especially when they give you like director's cut as well. Wait, I've never done a rush here. So wait, is there new areas or is there not new areas? I actually can't tell. Also, bro, what? Okay, I was gonna say, oh, what is happening here, chief? Oh, okay, we took a cheeky little down. That's whatever. But yeah, what was I saying about blood? Yeah, like the Easter egg's not that bad. I actually quite like 
the gauntlet for this map as well. It really was not that difficult. Like compared to some of the other gauntlets I had to do in that gauntlet video, Bloods was like nowhere near as bad. Also, it's not looking good for us boss man. <laughs> I don't know how much longer we're going to be able to survive to be completely honest with you. Oh my god. Oh, we did get full power though. I'm still yet to get my, my natural one, which is like really random. It's been nearly full for like the last like two minutes. Like game, please give me my fucking specialist, bro. I should have just picked that one up. I was trying to get it and then use it a little bit, but I managed to get that one. Yeah, we didn't do these ones originally. Oh, okay. We're coming up to like our last life here. Oh, we've got like two more lives to be fair. But to be honest, like I I'm actually happy. Four million points. Pretty much maxed out. I'll see what like my actual points was at the end. I don't know why they can only show four million points. Like there's definitely room on there. It's <laughs> like go to at least like 99 million. But I don't know. Maybe they just didn't think people were going to go that long. I just had a phone call like a second ago while we're up on the roof. And like apparently the high score of this map is like actually like 61 million or something like that. And the multiplier was like 2,700. Like it's actually wild. <laughs> and I thought four million points. I thought I was like him, bro. But for me personally, look, I I'm happy. But they pretty much had like the same tactic where pretty much it was just shield when you're, you know, not got a specialist or anything like that. So, so just so like you're actually like protected and stuff like that. Oh, we're dead. Um, oh, there you go. Look, there's my final score. Like 4,194,000. Yeah, then it's just like getting lucky with like drops and stuff like that. So look, I'm happy, right, bro? We maxed it out. And that's all that matters in my book. So yeah, we're blooded. They're done. Let's just go ahead and move on to our next map, which is classified. All right, and so classified is up next. We can actually go straight for the mystery box. That's actually like pretty good. So I won't lie. Rush is getting a slight, you know, a bit boring. <laughs> I can't lie. I've pretty much been playing it for like an hour and a half straight now. Yeah, it do get kind of boring on the third, you know, fourth map in. So like, I feel like if, you know, everything is just down in the water, like no ammo, we'll, we'll just call it a day. But, I mean, you guys don't want to see me just down over and over again. Or maybe you do. I don't know. Maybe you're into that type of thing. I mean, who knows? Maybe we'll get another like 4 million point game. I don't know. <laughs> I don't think we will. I don't think anything's going to go as crazy as the Blood of the Dead game. Also, I'm not going to take that monkey bomb because Ray Fires, I feel like a better, especially when like I had the homunculus, did not feel that good. So I'm going to take these Ray Fires instead to be completely honest with you. But, yeah, that's what we'll do. All right. If everything is just down in the dumps, you know, no sign of comeback, uh, we'll call it a day. Or if I reach 4 million points, we'll call it a day. Because once I hit 4 million points on Blood of the Dead, bro, I, I was like kind of, I was kind of over it to be honest. So yeah, we'll figure something out. Plus, most people click off our video anyways by now, apparently. See, that's something that's like weird, right? So unless you're like a YouTuber, or know anything about YouTube, you probably won't know what I'm all about, but YouTube will give you like an average view duration of like how long people, you know, watch your video on average. And a good chunk of it is like not even halfway. Well, I mean, like sometimes it's halfway, but it's really weird. Like, I don't really understand how YouTube gets that metric, you know? Unless you guys just aren't watching me all the way, you know? What if I just said, you know, like the N-word right now? How many people are actually going to hear me? <laughs> it's going to be really out of the blue. But there's a lot of times, right, where I'll see some someone who like in a way like judges a youtuber for looking at their stats or they'll be like oh no i don't look at my stats because i don't know it's like demotivating or you know however they want to say it but the thing about looking at your stats right especially on youtube is something i've learned is it's more important than just looking at your views or a click through rate or anything like that and just being like oh well this video did bad etc you know not every video is going to be a banger right this goes to anyone who wants to be like a, a youtuber or whatever you know look at your past videos see what videos have worked for you in the past like whenever i make videos right like easter egg videos seem to do better than pretty much majority of the content i post so, you know, naturally, when I post something that, you know, isn't Easter egg related, probably like this video, I'm not expecting it to get like a million views, you know what I mean? So, you know, don't get demotivated by your stats if, you know, you're, you're trying to grow on YouTube. Just use them to see what your audience likes and go from there. It, it really is just that simple. Like, I had somebody you know, in the zombie community who I won't name, but like, they, they came up to me and was like, oh, I just don't know what to post. Like, have you got any ideas? I'm like, well, I can't tell you that. Just look at your analytics. <laughs> and it's literally everything you need is right there. That will tell you what your audience watches, like who they watch, like what content seems to be most popular for your channel. It tells you literally right there in front of you. It seems like now everyone just resorts to making a 50 plus perk video because FPS did it and it did well and everyone's like well I'm gonna jump on that bandwagon. Right, either way that's enough of like YouTube stuff to be honest uh, I don't get anyone really cares. Came here for the British man to do British things so you know what it actually is criminal I've not had a crumpet in fucking like genuinely months. See I'm British but for all like the wrong reasons than like what Americans or whatever would think right like I don't like tea right I'm gonna be the one to say it now but like at the same time I feel like really cheap shitty energy drinks are very British like I don't know like you know those like 30p cans that like just fully grey if you ever seen those about that's like the roadman drink right that's like the, the classic like british corner shop b-tech energy drink so right you know i love energy drinks so that's like the most british thing about me to be honest i do like crumpets though crumpets do kind of go hard but also i just lost my book player. are you actually serious why am i even sitting in that room bro what am i even up to i was a bit quirky just chilling in there also this is not great okay we had a really strong start and then i've literally just thrown it away <laughs> like, why have i done that bro i've got like rape i'm literally just not utilizing my, my like my equipment or anything like what am i actually doing i'm a little goofball a little silly billy as they would say Right, it's fine. We're gonna bring it back. We're gonna have the biggest comeback in the entire world. You're not even ready for it. As long as I can reach a million points, like I'm happy, right? Power is in fact on now, which means pack winch is available. And we're actually heading there right now. So before I go, I do want to try and get a better weapon from the box. Uh this cordai. Uh the cordite is well, I mean it's gone now, but it's alright. It does have a lot of ammo, but that was honestly about it. 
still yet to get the helium salvo again. Honestly criminal. So why am I back here? Oh, and there goes my multiplier as well. There's really nothing I can do, just watch it go down. I don't really feel like this map is going to be too great for Rush. I feel like it's kind of all over the place at the moment, but we're nearly halfway there. So as long as I don't get hit by anything like too stupid, we can probably just quickly make it to a million points. For some reason though, this is, like genuinely feels harder than any other map. Like, bro, how am I getting hit? Actual skill issue. What is that? An insta kill? Okay, that's kind of big. Just need to build up that multiplier again. I feel like if I can get to like 200, we're in like a comfortable position. So at that point, I like, just don't get hit. Okay, we need to go to the pig room next, but to be fair, okay, they are coming from behind. I thought they weren't. I didn't think they'd do that to me. All right, let's just go then. Again though, I'm losing my multiplier and there's no zombies here, so I can save it. Oh, well, there we go. We've got some uh, these like little pickup thingies. All right, let's get in the mood here. Let's get in the game. All right, let me pop a red bull. There we go. We're back in. Now, what is good, my guy? Now, Helion Salvo. Okay, the Hitchcock. Right, I'm sure there's some people out there laughing like, ha, he said the funny cop word. I don't really want to kill the pig. Oh, I think I've just owned him. Isn't I? That explosion just definitely killed him. Oh, bro, no, my, he's he's just chilling, bro. He actually said, nah, I got you, bro. I don't even sweat it. I ain't passing that one anytime soon. Okay, uh, throw that down. Try not to lose my ball play. There we go. What have we got? All power. That's kind of big. And then it's kill. That's also kind of fat. So fat. Fucking Pyro Cynicals probably requesting NSFW out of it. Okay, let's pull this away. Grab that. Grab this. Okay, you know what? We're making a comeback. As I said, we're actually on the moon. Conference room. Okay, let's head up there. Hopefully, all the zombies just spawn up here and don't just lose a mortal player. Okay, there we go. We managed to save it. Let's go. Dude, and we got another full power over there. So, pop this real quick. Get us some extra kills. Not having to worry about being too weak. Hold on, I'm getting too close. All right. Defend the area. Okay, I, bro, this is actually going like really well. It's, all you got to do is just run around with a shield out so you can't get hit. And it's kind of free from there. I'm not even going to lie to you. Like, your guns are actually pretty fucking useless in this mode. Like, other than like the Helion Salvo, everything else is genuinely kind of useless. They just don't kill. And then when they start speeding up, it's just, oh my God, how am I getting out of this? Um, the Q ability, there we go. Making some big moves. Right, we're actually nearly at a million. Managed to build up a nice little cheeky combo here. I feel like I've definitely gotten better from Voyager's Despair. This is probably one of my worst maps recently. Oh my God. Uh, hold up. Let's just get out of here. Oh, I do not like this area at all. I do not like this like situation we're in. We need to end it so I can get myself another shield. I could just pop a gobble gum to be fair, but I think if I could just kill this guy, maybe no. Not the end of the round. Bro, where's the end of the guy? Where's the last guy, bro? Is him? No. Oh, you bro. Okay, we're good. We're good. I thought I'd been hit there. That was actually kind of squeaky, but I'm coming here. Pick up our shield. There we go. War room lower level. Okay, let me head down there real quick. I need to cool the elevator back up. Oh, probably good helium salvo. Okay, uh, take this. That's an unbelievable W boss, man. Uh, not a single zombie in sight, though. So my multiplier is just dropping. Like zombies. Like, where are we actually at? There we go. Holy shit. Okay, this could be a big run. If I can build up a decent multiplier in this area and manage to pack a bunch of helium salvo, this could be kind of big for us. So let me see how I can get this bad boy. We, we might as well reach a million points, which is really good. At this point, though, I'm aiming for two million. Uh, okay, I don't like. I've got no shield on my. What's it, though? We're all good. Focus is up here. Oh, there's another full power over there. Very good. Bro, look, you actually get your specialist back really quick in this mode. That's something I've noticed. Maybe that's the tactic, boys. You just put that one ray fire, get a shitload of kills. It gives you back your specialist pretty much instantly. Ah, but you're yeah, developing tactics. Okay, let me head in here real quick. Try and pack up this Helion Salvo. So there we go. Probably gonna lose a good chunk of my multiplayer here. Oh, never mind. We, we saved it, boys. How does he do it? Okay, here we go. I'm running here as well. I think the shield should be here. There we go. And we're back here. I wonder if that means we've done a full loop of the map now. Because I'm generally not sure because like Blood of the Dead, right? Like we had already done some of those areas, but then randomly they're just like throwing this new area. So I, I don't really know. It doesn't really matter either way. Okay, we have lost our armor. So let's just be a little bit more careful here. Just do some of these little bad boys. There we go. Pull out the shield. Oh uh, yeah, I do want to test this, right? Because it does seem like you get it back ridiculously fast. Yeah, I mean, look at that, bro. Like, what do you mean? It's already back. That's crazy. Okay, this is the strategy going forward. 100%. Just hit him with one of these. There we go. Okay, now that I actually understand how to like play the mode, I'm getting a hang of it. What is good, Mr. Pig? We do need to make our way back up to the offices. So uh, let me just grab his insta kill and then we go. Oh, I am losing my multiplier. So save it real quick. There we go. Head up here. Okay, we've got a good multiplier going. Okay, we just hit 2 million. I'm thinking we could maybe max this out. As long as I play it like smart and I don't play it just stupid dumb, we could definitely get 4 mil here. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Okay, let me just come over here and grab this. Pull back out my specialist. Get some more kills. Okay, we need to go to the research lab. Head down there real quick. Oh, we're back to the pig room as well. See, I'm always worried about going to the pig room because I really just don't want to kill him. I mean, bro is just like hanging. I don't know, bro. I just, I can't bring myself to kill him. Oh, bro. No, bro. What happened? Why is that? What happened, bro? Where did all these zombies come from? Oh my God. We just lost like a 500 times more reply. That is actually criminal, bro. Oh, we're definitely not reaching that fucking 4 million mark now. Bro, what? What the fuck happened, bro? 
How is this? How how has this gone this badly in a whopping like four seconds, bro? Oh my god, dude! I'm playing like such a like a little dumbass now. Oh, dude. Okay, it's it's kind of over for us. I mean, I suppose we can keep going. See if I can maybe hit like the three mil mark, bro. I, I cannot believe I just fumbled it like that. All right, we need to defend this area real quick. Uh oh, uh, this is not good. How have I got myself in this situation, bro? <laughs> what am I doing, bro? I'm I'm still in shock. Like, honestly, got shocked that I lost a 500 times water player that way. No, at least I know now that it, like the next maps. Bro, what? Oh my, bro, what? That kind of sucks. Yeah, I mean, we do have this healing on Salvo. Okay, let's not just give up to just yet. Okay, hold up. Okay, bro, maybe, maybe, maybe giving up is the sign. <laughs> I see Tom Norris this point. I had like a second of hope. This immediately gets shot down. Bro, holy shit. This is like just getting ridiculous, bro. Yeah, I don't think we're getting to free mil. I mean, I can try my little hardest, put my heart and soul into it, but bro, I just keep getting hit, bro. Like, I, I'm pulling up my specialist game. Bro, okay. Uh, literally nothing I can do, bro. I'm putting away the specialist. I'm putting it away, game. All right, well, this is kind of like done and dusted my guess would be like bro they're so quick honestly bro like, they're actually just jumping at like, the opportunity to cut at me oh honestly bro these zombies think i'm a fucking 13 year old girl and they're cosplaying as fucking too mad bro like i'm actually just getting bummed right, let's get out of here i'm done with the labs i hate the labs the labs suck all right here we go i mean maybe if i played the best game of rush in my entire life I could maybe squeak out the free mill i don't even know anymore bro i've got so many mixed emotions literally all you need is just that strong start right at the beginning and then like that's it also this tactic here just is not working like at all now i don't know what happened to it like i don't know why it's just randomly decided it doesn't want to give me as much towards my weapon specialist but that really do just be how it be we're also only like 50k points away from getting to this free mill so we could hit it we could so to make sure i don't get hit say that as i proceed to get actually just like double whammied all right we managed to complete that brush oh my god dude these are getting kind of tough now especially with the shield just constantly breaking as well it doesn't help all right here we go wait did the pig die oh it's over i don't even care anymore i'm getting the free mill points and i'm ending the game i'll just can't even be in a world like this anymore i guess this is how track like ramps up the difficulty i suppose like they just make it so you don't get your specialists as often and speed up the zombies and give like no max ammos oh, okay we managed to hit three mill points okay I i'm happy i think we pretty much like maxed out what i'm gonna be able to do on this map because i don't think i'm gonna be able to build up a big enough combo to reach four million the areas are just so like small bro that i'm already about to die again look at this yeah dude it's it's kind of over okay I i'm just gonna end the game because you know what it's i'm done with classified <laughs> we got three million points so i mean I i'm happy so i guess let's go ahead and move on to our next map which is dead of the night i'm gonna try and rack up a massive combo here Boys, it's gonna be the biggest combo you've ever seen. You're not even ready for it. You know what? I'm so confident. I'm even gonna pop per colleague, bro. I'm ready. You don't even realize. Can't find the zombies. I'm losing my combo. Okay, there they are. I mean, look at that. All right, we're pretty much there. There you go. All right, we need to grab these little bad boys. Ah, uh, multiplier even higher. Because can it get much higher, boys? That is the real question. I could really do it with a better weapon. Because I'll be honest, I don't think this RK7 garrison is gonna put me out for too much longer. But I think the. Oh my god, dude. Oh, my combo, bro. You know what the issue is? I'm gonna spawn me in a shield, bro. That was what the problem was. Look, well, now I can't I've ever lose my combo because I got victorious toys as well guys i'm actually too smart for this oh here you go boys we've got the akimbo sorgs feel like a little devil right now a little deviant I feel like an american student i'm going in right now with these bullets oh okay so we need to get to the dining area okay i think there is a box down here so we could have a chance to get the helium salvo if i get that it's pretty much like it's pretty much a game to be honest i right, got the an94 it's kind of a bit of an l right, we're going in boys cheeky melee weapon boys going in for the win i was riding 87 times combo right now we're already 100k pretty much i have five lives i actually cannot be stopped so the spitfire oh, the spitfire is actually pretty good Oh, okay. It says doors open, but I don't know what doors have been open. But okay, all right. So we gotta go to the main area next. Easy stuff, to be honest. Do I need a zombie I'm about to lose my combo? Where they at? Actually taking their time, bro. All right, let me get in the zone, boys. Also, this Spitfire like actually shoots so quick. It's actually mad. But also, we got a werewolf. That's a, a little bit bad. Hopefully, this Spitfire kind of just clowns on him. You know, I'm getting this weird feeling that it's not doing anything. Oh, dude, I lost my combo. You actual rat boy, get out of here. That's annoying me. I got a little bit grumpy from that. Oh my god, dude, we lost more of our combo. You know, I'm, I'm not even stressing about it. Like some actual plays right now. Is that like world records for a rush? Oh, we got homunculus. That's pretty good. Also, pack a bunch is now available. I'm gonna go do that. I'm gonna pack this uh Spitfire because this is really good. And you know what? The shits and giggles are uh, my pack a bunch is sorg nine millimeter if it lets me. It's not letting me. That's a little bit sad, but they're not really I don't really know what the criteria is. Can you only do it like once every now and then or like I guess it doesn't really matter, but let's make our way over to the greenhouse. Alright, we're pretty much halfway to where we want it to be. So I see this as a win right now. And we have five lives still. We're doing really well. Oh my god, dude, we're 120 26 per uh, multiplier right now. 130, bro. We're going in. I feel like this had all the sweats play, right? With like the shield and uh, victorious toys. We already got a hammer back. That was already quick. I wonder if the uh, the hammer has been like increased. Well, actually, we might actually hit a 200 multiplier here. And there we go, boys. We hit 200. Actually, little gamer. All right, but the Nosferatu's are coming in. They're a little bit squeaky, right? I don't really like those. This is upcoming defend area village room, right? Let's make our way over there. But right now, my combo is pretty high. So now we'll go ahead and hit the box. See if maybe we can get the healer. Oh my god, boys. This healer on salvo is actually massive 
massive. Can I go pack a bunch of that? Game, come on. I know you want the pack a bunch of that. Oh my god, let's go. Boys, we're set. Boys, actually done and dusted deal right now. And we still have like six lives, by the way. Okay, we did just lose our combo, which is kind of upsetting. Do we lose it if we damage ourselves? Oh, we have PhD sliders, so I don't have to worry about that. Also, we are running up kind of close on what our objective for this map was. Okay, I've lost all my combo, by the way. It's kind of heartbreaking, but not even sweating it, right? Okay, then throw down our homunculus. That'll do all the job for me. All right, there we go, boys. We only need like 50k more. It's like, it's more like, like 60k more. All right, it's 50k more now. Boys, we're actually making out of these ends. Oh, okay, there we go, boys. We have 550 pals. I wouldn't even realize. Right, well, I guess now we just see how long we can survive for. If we can get a million, kind of hype, but we need to build up a, a bigger combo again. I've kind of been letting my streak go, you know? So I think the plan is right. It's just run around with the shield so you don't take any damage or lose my combo in silly ways. And then once I've got them kind of like built up a little bit like this, just go to town with the Helion Salvo and build up a nice little combo. And honestly, I feel like that's kind of the strat. Let's just get hit there, which is kind of unfortunate, but uh, I don't think there's anything else ready to get out of the box. I mean, this will take this MP40. Also, I think we're doing a loop now of just the map, uh, which I'm fine with, unless at some point we're going to make like a, a move around to um like the graveyard. But by the looks of it, like this is it. I'm having a more fun time on Dead of the Night than I was on 9, to be honest. I still think night, uh, Dead of the Night is like criminally hated, by the way. He's right, we're building a big combo again, right? 120. Let's pull out my uh, hammer. Go to town on these little bad boys. Obviously, once it's gone, I think you just literally pull out the heat on. Get a few kills. Like, look at that. Like, that I think the, the recharge rate of the specialist is definitely higher in this as well. So, like, look at that. We already have a hammer bag. Yeah, this is 100% the strategy, boys. My fucking left arm is going number. I'm gaming so hard. And we're about to hit a 200 combo again. There we go, boys. We might actually hit a million. We just need to um get 130k more, pretty much. Which I don't actually think will be as bad as uh, you think. Look, one kill is pretty much getting us, like, 2k there. Here we go, boys. So we have to stay up in this area, which kind of sucks. It's not the best spot in the world, but I guess it'll have to do for now. Yeah, these zombies are starting to break through my shield. This isn't good, boys. Oh, we got to a million. We got to a million. Yo, bro, we did it. Actually, too easy. I wasn't even so wet. Oh, my God. Okay, we did go into Dying Wish. Also, Dying Wish seems to be a massive player in this, by the way. All right, let's pop our uh, hammer again. Make sure we go to town. Oh, my God, there's a werewolf. There two pier double points up there. I kind of want it. Oh, my God, I'm getting stuck. Bro, I do have, like, seven lives, though. No matter. I've not actually died a single time. All right, let's make our way back to the main hall, boys. It should be a nice area to train in because it's, like, kind of open ish in the mausoleum, all right? So, right, let's whip out the specialist, boys. Let's go into town. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, that's actually just unfortunate, bro. My specialist ran out and just got swarmed. They are, like, they're sprinting now, by the way. It's actually our first down, you know? You guys are sprinting, bro. What the fuck? Actually, step back. Oh, my God. Oh, my God, bro. I didn't realize I haven't had a shield anymore. Dude, these seven lives are not lasting as long as I thought. Oh, my God, bro. They are just hitting so hard. Bro, what? I lost my Helion Salvo. Bro, I didn't even realize I lost my Helion. Okay, well, this is over, bro. I actually can't believe I lost that. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Yeah, we're <laughs> dead, bro. We are dead. Um, well, I guess we're just waiting for our lives to despawn, I guess. Maybe hit, we could hit a whopping score of 1.2 million before we uh, officially die. Oh, we got an extra life, boys. Don't even worry about it. Right, well, they got 1.2 million, boys. Well, we're definitely not hitting 1.3 million. I can tell you that for sure. Right, I don't even know how we completed that rush. Oh my god, dude, I just get wiped out, bro. You actually do need the Helion to like, do well in this. It seems to be like a mix between, like, using the special weapons and using your Helion salvo and having victorious toys for the shield. That honestly feels like what the strategy here is. Oh, you got to the rush, bro. I'm dead. <laughs> what, bro? What? There's a grenade there. Where'd that grenade come from? Bro, it's actually some squeaky bum time, bro. I'm not gonna lie, I kind of thought we'd be dead by now. Oh, well, there you go. <laughs> no 1.3k for your boy. Oh, and there's our last, like, revive that we can use. So, bro, it's MP40. It's actually dead, bro. Oh, and there I go. Okay, boys. And boys, so Ancient Evil is next. Now, this one is gonna be a little bit more interesting because Ancient Evil isn't, like, the hardest map in the world. But there is some spots where it can be a little bit tight. So, it really just depends on where they decide to put all the rush points. Like, bro, if there's a rush on this bridge, like, that is not gonna be the easiest thing in the world. Okay, we do have the Amphitheater. That's not too bad. That was Swordfish just for now. There is a box here. You know, I'm gonna hit the box. The thing is, right, it's like Helion Salvo genuinely just did not feel that worth it. Like, I'm gonna be the guy to say it, right? And I'll bum off the Helion Salvo. But, like, low key was not really helpful for me to be completely honest with you. I mean, we'll just see. I get it. I get it. If I don't, it's, like, it's not the end of the world. See, now that I know the tactics, we can make some uh, we can make some big money man moves. So, our melee weapon, get some more kills. Pretty much, I just want to do what we did on, like, Blood of the Dead, for example. Oh my god, I just lost all my combo already. Not the greatest start, but yeah, pretty much, I just want to try and get, like, as high as a combo earlier on as possible, and then just go from there. Trying to speed run my way to a million points. But I ain't doing that without a shield, so there we go. Shield is just so important, like, genuinely. Like, if you for some reason want to play Bro, can you fuck off? You just made me lose my combo. Oh my. Okay, well, as I was saying, if you're for some reason wanting to play Rush and you're struggling, just run Victoria's Tortoise and have like a shield gobble gum and, and you'll be fine. All right, let's actually try and build up this combo now because I'm fed up with getting to like 50 and then just losing half of it. All right, it's going to be the real deal. You know, it's the big attempt. I'm glad that we only had to do one attempt now uh, for each map so far. I was a little bit worried that, you know, getting to a million points would be a little bit more difficult. Honestly, it's not actually that bad. Like as long as you can play well and you just don't 
like keep getting hit, it's honestly not that bad. Oh, bro, are you serious, bro? Like, come on, dude. I'm like, that's the thing that annoys me the most, right, about playing rush mode, right? It's when you put away the specialist, there's just a moment where there's just nothing you could do. Bro, I'm just getting collapsed right now. This is just not going my way. But yeah, there's like a moment where when you put it away, you're just vulnerable to like all attacks. And that's really kind of showing to be a problem for me. So by the looks of it, we're getting to a million and then we're done. Okay, we can package this. That might be a big help. So let's get ourselves the S12. I think that's what this gun was called. Like, I actually can't remember. I'm hoping this thing's good, like at least in the later rounds. All right, I'm going to focus up. I'm actually sitting up in my chair. You know what I mean? Where it's like, you know, he's like relaxing and he like sits up and actually focuses, you know, gets in the game. That's me right now. Right, I'm focusing up. Oh, bro, where the fuck am I? I need to go to the offer of Atlanta discs or whatever it is. I can't even pronounce that, bro. Atalids. Bro, I honestly thought for some reason it was all the way down there. Yo, we just move like that, honestly. Okay, we do have a Giganese or Giganese or whatever you pronounce his name. Bro was pretty ugly in that fucking image, so I'm not even going to lie. Like, what was going on there? Okay, but let's just collapse him up real quick. So, are you going to fly away? No? Okay. Bro just doesn't feel like it today, I guess. Bro, he, he doesn't feel like fucking disappearing. I feel like it's making me lose my entire combo. Do you actually mind, bro? Thank you. Like, actually back away. Bro, like, just fuck off. <laughs> if it's not become painfully obvious, I I'm starting to have my fill of uh, the rush mode. It just gets a bit boring after a while. Like, like it's the same thing just over and over again. I can kind of see why this mode just didn't take off with anyone. Like, gauntlets, I actually do think were genuinely underrated. Like, it was genuinely fun to, like, plan out those things. You know, try and, like, come up with tactics and plan ahead. And it was actually, like, really fun. And I feel like anyone who has Black Ops 4 and hasn't given that a try definitely should because you're actually missing out on a whole different part of the game. But Rush is like, bro, like, what even is it? <laughs> why does anyone want to play this? Like, it's fun for a few rounds and then that's it. Oh my god, and I'm just getting hit by just the stupidest things, bro. I wonder if maybe the combo you've got affects how quick things recharge. That's a really random thing. Like, I don't know why, but I feel like that honestly could be what it is. Oh my god. Bro, are you fucking- Oh, bro, this mode is actually getting on my nerves, bro. Making me low-key grumpy right now. Bro, how long is this area? Is this it? There we go. Oh my god, dude. Can I just get one good combo? That's all I need is just that one combo and then we're, we're good from there. I'm gonna repot my perk. Look, I'm not giving up on it just yet, right? I do want to try and hit a million. I do think I can do it. I just need to focus up and stop being a bit of a dum dum. All right, we're back up to 100 times combo. Come on, we can, we can make this work. We just need to head into the amphitheater, you know, get some cheeky kills, get a nice little combo on the go, and then, you know, happy days. Okay, here we go. This area does kind of suck, so I'm going to have to do a little bit of concentrating here, but we should be good. Pull out my hammer thing. I do need to be using the range attack on his hammer more often because getting close to the zombies is really what's screwing me over, especially when, like, it just randomly disappears or, like, when the time runs out, especially when, like it goes away. I just want to be like nowhere near any of the zombies at all. This area is a little bit better though. Actually, I lied if I said it was hard. This area is actually not that bad. Mainly just for the fact that it's quite an open area. Yeah, we can make this work. Look at the combo going up. Okay, come on. Let's just focus up here, Jake. Let's get a positive mindset. Also, you can see our um specialist is charging up so much quicker now. Again, I don't know if that's because of the combo. I was thinking there for a second it might have been because of double points, which would make a use for it. Like, you don't get two times the points, you get two times the speed and everything being like recharged. That would make a bit more sense. But, I mean, who knows? I guess I'll test it when we uh, eventually get another double points. Oh my god, it took a cheeky little hit, which isn't the greatest thing in the world. Let me just get to a million points. All right, well, we, we can still bring it back. Oh my god. Oh, uh, hold up. Pull shield, pull shield. Okay, we're good. Let's try get some kills. Okay, all right, we might just hit a million. Oh my god, dude. Is it even worth continuing, bro? Like, I am just not having a good time right now. I don't know what it is. Ancient Evil, it's a good map, but bro, it's popped up at the wrong time. <laughs> can we pick these up? Give me that. That's wrong. All right, I mean, I suppose I can just head down here. We'll, we'll go until I lose my Perkaholic. How about that? And look at this bro like how has this even happened okay game you're giving me some serious false hope here we're back up to a cheeky little 100 times combo if i can at least beat voyage then i'll be happy because voyage was like an actual be like bad attempt uh we do have that double points there actually could be a good time to test out whether or not it increases the charge rate whatever it is uh i don't know i feel like it might but i mean either way there we go 1.271 i don't know what i got to him i actually can't remember what i got up to in voyage remember it wasn't like super high it was something in the million I mean, rage oh my god dude you don't know what just fucking like, you know, i'm so dumb with what ancient evil bro i'm actually so over it all right we've got two maps left we've got alpha omega and then we have the totem so let's just power through these last two maps my brain is actually starting to hurt from playing so much rush you know what for your guys' entertainment and the fact that i need a video out literally today i guess the show must go on oh my god dude i'm already getting hit the, i feel bad right because i actually do genuinely enjoy black ops 4 like it really is not as bad as everyone really made it out to be but by god like what were they thinking with the rush mode like, i just genuinely want to know like they were cooking on some of these maps but just not this so honestly i think I'm just gonna get to a million points, move on to the next map, and let's just get this video done with. Alright, let's make a move. Uh, where's the box? Here we go. Okay, give me the heat on salvo. We've got the demon, or however you pronounce this. <laughs> I think I actually don't even know, boys. Honestly, there is some like gun names in this game that I just do not know how to say. Like, bro, how do you actually is it is it demon? Is it 
it Damien? I, I don't know. <laughs> Actually, I'm, I'm speechless, bro. This is the V-Cam, bro. The V-Cam is so cheeks. It's like the Gorgon, but like just genuinely worse. And I didn't even know the Gorgon can get worse. You know, that gun is like bottom tier trap. There's like an attachment, right, for the Gorgon that like makes it so it doesn't shoot as slow as it does. I'm pretty sure you can glitch that onto a zombie class in like a Black Ops 3. And it actually makes the gun semi-decent. Why there wasn't just an attachment in zombies? That gun is kind of beyond me. Also, I just picked up the ballistic knife. Are you actually joking? Well, I just don't have a weapon now. Let's go. Yeah, I genuinely like do not understand that at all. Okay, let me see if I can quickly get myself a new weapon. What is this? The Vapor? VP Vapor? This gun's actually not too bad. I actually like this gun. I can't remember what it reminds me of, but it's like really smooth to use. I don't know why. I was going to say the ACR, but oh, that's like an Infinity Ward type of gun. So I don't know what this thing's kind of like based on. Could just be a whole new weapon, but I feel like it's something from BO3. Honest to God though, I don't remember half the weapons from BO3. Like at least multiplayer wise. Is it the HVK? Is this the HVK? It could be, you know. HVK is also real smooth. Definitely ain't like the Man of War or anything like that. I need to stop talking about whether or not this gun is from like Black Ops 3 or not. It, it clearly isn't. All right, let's just move on. We need to get down to the lounge. I haven't had to use my specialist yet, so we do have that. Oh, dude, this area is kind of like on the tight side. Oh my God. Okay, I should not have left that. For some reason, I honestly like got the rush that even existed. So that kind of sucks. It was a little bit of a combo there, but you know, it is what it is. All right, we're kind of on the move, right? We're bringing it back. Can I pack a bunch? Uh, yes. Let me go ahead and try and do that real quick. So there we go. Also take a hit at the box, see if we can get something good. The Argus, I mean, literally like, bro, who is actually using the Argus in Black Ops 4 Zombies? I think it's actually kind of poopy as well. Like, I just don't understand it. Like, why bring it back and make it that bad? Because that gun didn't even come out at launch. Like, they had to personally add this in as like DLC. One thing I actually do enjoy about Black Ops 4 and something that BO3 definitely should have just had was that all of the DLC weapons just like barely ever came to zombies. Like, obviously Zombie Chronicles had it and I think Zestable had one as well. You know what I mean? Like, right? Like, majority of the multiplayer weapons just never came to zombies. And I said this in one of like my custom zombie map videos where like one of them had just a bunch of the like DLC weapons. Right, they're like so interesting to use. So I don't know why they didn't just throw them in the mystery box and give them a pack a punch, but you know, that's Treyarch's decision, not mine. Oh my god, we got hit. Are you actually joking? There's a zombie fucking he rolled out the way. You know what? It's, it, it's fine. I have no enemies. Alright, they're bringing in the Jolt and Jax. Can I spawn like upstairs? If I just chill here, am I good? I think I'm good if I just chill here. Do spot an Alpha Omega Rush mode. Okay, we're at half a million. We're kind of schmoozing. Not doing as bad as you know at the start. I'm just taking some really dumb hits and it's like really annoying me. It's very similar to when I play like Infinite Warfare Easter eggs, right? Because I know some of like the speedrun strategies and stuff like that. Like if I don't feel like I get a good enough time, it like annoys me, like unbelievably annoys me. Like I'm not a perfectionist by any means, but I don't know, bro. When I know I can do something, but then just ultimately fail. Really ticks me off. Like, as Peter Griffin would say, it really grinds my gears. I do need to be careful about these jumping jolts, so. Okay, I do need to be careful about these jumping jolts, so because they are shooting shit at me and for one hit and there is going to be a hole in my desk. Oh my god. Okay, let's pop the katana let's go in get crazy get gamer mode yeah i definitely think double points is what's helping uh, recharge my specialist faster it's got to be that right because literally right there like it just did a massive jump the inner machinations of rush mode yeah, i think that's what okay, patrick star says yeah the cordite i mean not really what i want to be completely honest with you i might just try and pack a bunch of spitfire and then go from there spitfire is really good okay, is this it very nice the stingray honestly the stingray is kind of built with weapon like honestly it actually kind of goes like unbelievably hard i need to make sure i don't get fucking destroyed while i try and pack a bunch here also getting closer and closer to that 1 million points. So I think as long as I don't lose my combo here, or at least like not too much, eh, it went down a bit, but honestly, I think we'll probably be fine. I need to make sure I don't get hit by these jumping jolts. So. Actually, they're so annoying. Like, bro, no one likes overcrawlers. So like, why add more of them? Treyarch, what were you thinking, bro? I, I, I genuinely want to hear like Treyarch's thought process behind some of these map decisions. Because like, for example, right, the jumping jolts, they're not even like a cool enemy. It's the fucking of an overcrawler. Like, oh my God. Dude, oh my God, bro. I just lost my entire combo. Fucking, this because these fucking overcrawlers, bro. Oh my God. Bro, I'm actually having a bad day, bro. Like, bro, honestly, you'd think fucking Sansa just, like, attacks me or some shit, bro. Like, I'm having an absolutely appalling evening. All right, so we're going to have to try and rebuild up this combo if I want to have an actual attempt to get into a million points. We're 60k away, so all we really need is, like, I don't know, like, 100 times combo or something like that. And honestly, like, we'll be fine. Hey, all right, you know, we're bringing it back very slowly, but never mind, I just absolutely threw my run. Sorry if, like, the ass end of this video. It just seems like I'm getting really annoyed at the mode and kind of just rushing through things. Things, no pun intended, but yeah, I'm trying to get this video out literally the same day I'm recording it. And what that means is I can't really space these things out. If I could, it wouldn't be as bad. But yeah, you know, there's probably going to be a video tomorrow anyway. So I think if we get these last, bro, we're 500. Okay, never mind. I was going to say, bro. I was about to say, we just made it. All right, there we go. We got a million points. Is it worth me even continuing on? Probably not. So you know what? I'm going to go ahead and just end the game. Got to a million points. That was the goal. With that, let's just go ahead and move on to our final map for this video, which is Tag the Totem. All right, boys. So our final map. I had to whip out the Russie for this. You know, like you do. So 
hopefully everything goes all right. Obviously, if I can just big brain it, make sure I don't get hit, we can be there in actually no time at all. Bro, how many zombies are there in this time room? Dead ass, bro. Like, I swear, this is the longest so far. Like, bro, there we go. Jesus. Let's see. When is the door opening? This didn't feel like it, I suppose. All right, let's get hit this box. We're going to get the VMP. VMP and not for me because I'm going to be trading this little bad boy out. I mean, it'll do for now, I suppose. Yeah, I don't really know what I want. I mean, obviously, the Helion Salva would be nice. It didn't really seem to do like a massive thing for us because the zombies are so quick. They'll just hit you while you're in the middle of shooting shots. So, yeah, here we go. Lower lighthouse. Here we get ready. S606 or whatever it is, bro. Oh, a chance of my picking that up. Right, also, I think I've been like kind of neglecting a little bit is using the special in the early rounds. Like, I don't need to just use my weapon, right? Like, I can recharge this little bad boy up real quick. So, I think for this final map, I'm going to focus a bit more on just trying to get the kills rather than like trying to preserve using like specialists and stuff like that. I mean, look at that, right? Like, I just immediately got one back. All it does for me is it just gives me a little bit extra bit of protection and it gives me a really strong tool to kill zombies. So, let's just play it safe out here. Play it smart. Next, we're in the four castle. So, I do need to make my way over there at some point. Wait, that just lose a combo. Wait, are you actually serious? I just lost my combo from an exploding zombie from a mile away. I'm I'm sorry, bro. What? Right, you know what? I'm going to pretend that was a one-off thing. If that happens again, I'm I'm not going to be happy, bro. And I feel like at that point, that kind of shows that Treyarch just did not give a fuck about its mode at the end of Black Ops 4. Like, they, they rushed together at a quick rush mode and just said, like, yeah, we're done, bro. Enjoy. Because if I'm going to kill zombies that are on fire from, like, a million miles away just to make sure I don't lose my multiplayer, I'm not going to be happy, bro. Like, that is a little bit ridiculous. You know what? It's fine. We still got a pretty decent combo going. You know, like, 130. You know, it's a, it's delectable. You know, I, I'm happy with that. So let's just move to the next area. Kill that zombie all the way over there so he doesn't hit me first. All the way up in navigation. Now, this could be a bit squeaky. It is quite a tight area, if I'm not mistaken. So maybe pop on there's my walk-in. I'm not really too sure. Oh, no, it's just here. Oh, no, we're good, bro. Not even a single issue. Dude, the navigation is all of, like, this area. Okay. Yeah, we're, we're solid, bro. We're good. Electrify zombies are incoming. Let's go. Love those guys. They also blow up and do slight damage to me. So I'm sure that's going to be real fun to maintain my combo with those guys. I'm sure it was all, you know, perfectly planned out by Treyarch. I'm actually not too sure if I did lose my combo there. I'd assume I did, but I don't know. Maybe the game's nice with those ones. We are about to hit 200, though. My dog is yapping, bro. Look, dog, do you actually mind? I'm trying to record rush mode, bro. Okay, so it says we need to use a zip line. So this seems to just be on, so let's just take this over here. So I'll take the Maddox. I think this is meant to be like the Man of War of this game, to be honest. Like, it's very slow. Yeah, let's go. Again, okay, I'm ready to start the rush. There we go. So if I can do this area without getting hit, um, we can build a combo of like 250 or something like that. Like, this should be kind of free. Because then the next rush, there should be enough zombies. I need to just like put us up to a million. I mean, look, we're already at 400,000. So the zombies on this map seem so much slower though. Like from what I've noticed, it's just ridiculously slow. But look at this, bro. Like, how is this a rush? There's barely even zombies. That's a mild jog if I've ever seen one. Okay, well, either way, we head back down to the dock. So if I just come in here, just take the zip line and we can be on our way. So there we go. Game, I do need like one zombie though, just so I can save my ball player, please. <laughs> Literally lost like, I don't even know. What, what, what did I lose? Like 60, 50, 60 years? Or because there wasn't a single zombie that spawned in? That, that's, that's hype, bro. Keep my distance away from that guy. Yeah, I mean, we're at 500,000 now. We are slowly cooking. I do need to make sure that I'm not going out of bounds here. Oh, and we lost our combo. Let's go. That's like actually completely my fault though, to be fair. Should have always been running with my shield out. Okay, where do I need to go next? It's a lower lighthouse. Okay, I can do that. Let me just pack up my weapons real quick as well, just so I you know, actually have something to kill with. Oh, we got my Trojka dolls. Uh, now that I think about it, I probably shouldn't have traded out my Ray Fighters for this, but you know what? What's done is done. Gotta live with your consequences. Bro, these zombies are like ridiculously slow. Like, compared to what we had before in some of these other maps, this is like some Weenie Hut Jr. shit. Like, th th that's it. That's like it's the rush mode complete. But like the rush of that area, like that was just ridiculously slow. You know, whatever. And they might be complaining like, oh, so you complaining it, you know, it was too hard before and now it's too easy. Well, yeah, bro. Blood of the Dead, right? I actually think it was a decent difficulty. Then you got like Ancient Evil that's just throwing out every single zombie like in the nearby area at you. Then you've got this and there's just no zombies. <laughs> so it's like, you can't really win, I suppose. I think I've just come to the conclusion. I'm just not a fan of the rush mode like at all. It's fun for maybe like one game, but more fun with friends as well. But playing pretty much <laughs> eight games of rush, it honestly loses its charm. It's like the same with Easter eggs though. Like, like I'll be real. Sometimes the Easter egg videos are a bit of a pain in the ass to make because you've just got to sit there and just do the same Easter eggs that you've done like multiple times. Just do what they get. You know, it does kind of lose a bit of its charm every single time you do it. Also, fucking literally, it killed them all the way over there and bro still hit me. Absolutely crazy. But yeah, at least Easter eggs, right? You always kind of have something going on, especially in like the later games. Like, I'll be real, bro. Like Black Ops 1 Easter eggs are just so fucking boring, bro. <laughs> they are honestly abysmal. So yeah, it kind of has the same effect, except just like a, a lot quicker. Gauntlets were actually like genuinely underrated. I'm gonna be the guy to say it, bro. I actually had a lot of fun making that gauntlet video. It was a massive like pain in the ass, especially with like some of the stuff it made you do. But overall, it was actually a really fun video to make. Also, these fucking fire zombies are just pissing me off, bro. Like, like what am I meant to do, bro? They're just literally just to remove your combo. They just delete it from existence.
nonsense. All right, we're already like 100,000 points away though. I think once I hit a million, that, that's just it, bro. <laughs> that is just it. I, I never want to touch this mode again in like a 10 foot radius. But look, bro, this guy, he's going to kill me. He's going to hit me, bro. There's nothing I could do about that. You'd think, right, having PhD slider would protect you from the explosions, but I, I guess they literally just said like, nah, bro, we're good. You know, interesting decision from, uh, from Treyarch's end. You know what? They made interesting decisions throughout this entire game's life cycle. So, oh my God, bro. I just saw something on Twitter, like in between these rounds. There's a new Steam game coming out, literally called like Epstein. And you'd like fight a boss or some shit like that by the sound of the description. Believe it or not, called Jeffrey. This game, I've got to check out, bro. Like, I, I just need to see if Stephen Hawkins in it. You know what I mean? Bro, I swear, if, if I play it right and Dream pops up, <laughs> I'm going to be left speechless, bro. All right, we're ready there, boys. We're making it. 10,000 more points. We, we could honestly get it here. Yeah, I think we will. So, I mean, there we go, boys. We hit a million points. I think that's just going to be it because Rush Mode is actually genuinely hurting my head like i had to go take some like par well it's paracetamol in the uk i don't know what i can't remember what it's called in the in the us but like that and like some ibuprofen just because i had that much of a headache playing this it was actually just not it bro oh we have got a bit of a decent score though you know what? I'll, I'll keep going until i lose my arm okay there you go <laughs> less than four seconds bro and i just said like yeah i'm done see so, yeah, that's gonna be it for the video i do hope you guys enjoyed it i'm sorry if it felt a bit rushed at the end but as i said like bro i just got like an actual headache playing this and i do want to get this video out today because i don't like leaving you guys that long without any content okay so yeah, with that all said and done, please consider, you know, subscribing to the channel. I do want to try and hit 50k by the end of the year. I can't do it without your guys' help, all right? And if you guys do it, you guys are going to be officially be my best buds, all right? I've got 25,000 best buddies on the channel. And if you want to be one of my best buds, you know, you've got to hit subscribe. So, you know, for my main man, Russman, subscribe to the channel, you know, hit a like on the video. And yeah, you know, with that, I'll see you guys in the next video.